गाइस ओनली 61 डेज आर रिमेनिंग फॉर गेट डीए एग्जाम दैट इज टू बी हेल्ड ऑन फिफ्टीन फेब टू जीरो टू सिक्स मेजोरिटी ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स मशीन लर्निंग आर्टिफिशियल इंटेलिजेंस थ्री टॉपिक्स कंप्राइज द मेजोरिटी और द मैक्सिमम वेटेज इन गेट डी ए दैट आई टोल्ड यू दिस इज वन ऑफ द इम्पोर्टेंट सब्जेक्ट इट इज अ हाई प्रायोरिटी एरिया एंड यू शुड फोकस ऑन परम्यूटेशन एंड कॉम्बिनेशन Guys, only 61 days are remaining for Gate DA exam that is to be held on 15th Feb 2026. If I count it from today, guys, it is high time that you should now realize now what are the high priority subjects that you should focus firstly, okay, for Gate DA 2026. Okay, so guys, if you see the exam overview and weightage, already we have discussed this a lot of times. Exam date is 15th Feb and it would be CBT based test. Yes, and total hundred marks would be there, where general aptitude is fifty percent, and core DA that would comprise of eighty five percent. Okay, and guys, we would be getting MCQ, MSQ, and NAT. Okay, now gate data science and AI exams. Actually, this is this has been launched in two zero two four only, and the main motive of this exam was that it would check your comprehensive knowledge across multiple domains. where majority of mathematics machine learning artificial intelligence dbms along with this c programming and data structure would be checked okay so guys now firstly i'll just tell you uh, what exactly is the syllabus in mathematics you should have a very good knowledge on probability statistics linear algebra calculus and optimization so this three topics comprises the majority or the maximum weightage in gate da guys you should have no knowledge of statistical inference and data analysis techniques for linear algebra work more on data transformation side and for calculus optimization work more on algorithm development and model optimization side i'll be telling you each and every topic in detail in just a few slides after okay and then programming and data structure you should know the computational core skills implementing data science solutions and in dbms guys we should have data storage retrieval and transformation fundamentals and guys in machine learning you should have a good knowledge on supervised and unsupervised learning and for ai the ai fundamentals including the search algorithms sorting algorithms and much more okay now let us uh, see uh, what is the weightage of probability statistics guys it would comprise of around 14% I told you this is where one of the important subjects. It is a high priority area, and you should focus on permutation and combinations. Bayes theorem you should always do random variables with discrete distribution. Okay, where binomial and Poisson. This you should complete and continuous distribution. You should never leave this where normal and t distribution should be there. And in statistical inferences, you should be very confident. Z test, chi test. Okay, then central limit theorem you should. no confidence intervals for population parameters correlation covariation and regression analysis so guys this is very important in probability and statistics guys then if you talk regarding linear algebra so it would comprise of around 20% weightage and where vector spaces and subspaces eigen value eigen vector very important then matrix decomposition and linear equation and quadratic forms this is important and for calculus limit continuity differentiability taylor series expansion finding maxima minima and optimization technique so guys these are important topics for your mathematics you should always uh, uh, i mean revise this once before going okay then guys if you see programming data structure and algorithm that comprises of about 22% marks okay and weightage around 22% in gate uh, da and here you have to complete uh, the python programming fundamentals data structures there arrays stacks queues linked list trees hash tables and their implementation then sorting algorithms very important and graph theory so guys it is divided into four parts i mean the, uh, programming data structure and algorithm so this you should complete okay then in database management and warehousing we have uh, this is divided into two parts and see it comprises of around 10% the weightage is around 10% where a uh, focus should be on sql and normalization concepts okay and here database management okay where er model and relational database design then relational algebra operation then sql queries are very important guys then yes uh, other forms such as one uh, one normal form okay and indexing techniques for query optimization that is important and here data warehousing data transformation data warehouse schemas very important part 
then concept hierarchies and OLAP operations and then ETL processes and data integration. So here you have to focus more. Then uh, guys in machine learning, you should focus on supervised learning and in supervised learning we have number of algorithms starting from linear regression, logistics, support vector machine, decision tree, KNN and NaveBase. You should never leave any of these. Then neural network, their multi-layer perceptron architecture, feed forward network, back propagation and activation function. Then unsupervised may you should cover k-means, hierarchical clustering methods and PCA and LDA in case of supervised. Then model evaluation may these are very important concepts guys, bias variance trade-off, cross-validation technique. Okay, these are really very important concepts. Then I would focus on AI. Guys, AI syllabus is uh, comparatively low but yes, it may come for around 8 to 10 percent okay and search algorithms are important where uninformed informed and adversarial search these are important then knowledge and reasoning reasoning under uncertainty these topics are important and apart from this you should also focus on the logical part okay logics is also important here so the third part would be logics so here you should also focus on logics part Okay, so guys, strategic preparation and tips that I would like to just give you would be prioritize first on the high weightage subjects and what is the high weightage subject that is mathematics of course. Firstly, prioritize on mathematics. Then uh, we have 2024 uh, sample paper from uh, IASC. Okay, then uh, main 2024 gate paper then we have 2025 main gate paper to just attempt all these all the questions from these three papers then concept uh, clarity should be there guys uh, for attempting high level questions then time management is very important and guys you should always focus on quality resources because now only 61 days are remaining guys so try to focus more on the trusted uh, the books the trusted resources that you have now do not surf uh, i mean each and every book uh, the time is uh, time is gone only focus on revision and focus uh, majorly on the trusted resources that you have so guys this is all that uh, that is important and you should not leave any of these uh, topics that we have discussed and it would definitely benefit you okay thank you so much guys important and you should not leave any of these uh, topics that we have discussed and it would definitely benefit you okay thank you so much guys